We'll start to our Sunday morning right now here at Myrtle Beach, 74 degrees with partly cloudy skies. Now it's a little cloudy this morning, but more sunshine will be coming up as we get into the afternoon. But it's going to be a gorgeous day to be at the beach. Here's a look at your forecast. Highs reaching in the upper 80s, nothing but sunshine, blue skies. So make sure you put the sunscreen on. The UV index is very high. Water temperatures remain very warm at 85 degrees. And so here's what to expect for the next 48 hours. Mostly sunny skies today, warm conditions, upper 80s. As we hit the overnight hours, we'll see temperatures dropping down mid 70s, partly cloudy skies, and then temperatures continue to crank up as we head into Monday. Hotter temperatures and more humid, so highs, low 90s, but feeling like in the triple digits. And all this heat is coming from this high pressure system that's developing down towards our south over to Florida that continues to bring that warm and humid southwest winds across the Carolinas. So it's going to bring those hot, hazy, and humid conditions across the Carolinas. Look at our muggy meter today. Still steamy out there, but as we head into Monday and the rest of the week into that miserable category, in addition to that, temperature trends. Highs today here in the Grand Channel, as I mentioned, upper 80s, but by tomorrow, low 90s, mid 90s, Tuesday being the hottest day of the week. And we're gonna stay in the 90s for Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, but then add the humidity aspect to it. Again, triple digit heat index up to 105 on Tuesday. So if you are working out in the yard, make sure you take your, you know, bunch of breaks with the heat, keep yourself cool and hydrated. If you don't have to do yard work, do it in the morning hours. And so besides the heat, Here's a look at your update on the tropics. Luckily, there's no activity going on across the Atlantic. Few storms down towards our south, but according to the National Hurricane Center, there's no tropical activity for at least the next seven days. And so looking at our hurricane season, we're right around here at the um, beginning of August. But basically, the peak of hurricane season won't arrive as we head into about late September. So we still got a while. But for now, things are pretty calm and quiet in the tropics. As we look at your Sunday beach forecast, as I mentioned, mostly sunny skies. It's not really a big weather maker for the next couple of days. Just a 20% chance of rain. That's because we're just warm and humid for Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. As we continue to see an increase in heat and humidity, we'll start seeing that uptick at 30%. Temperatures still in the 90s, but luckily, as we get into next weekend, temperatures start to fall right back down into the 80s. And then as we look at your inlet forecast, sorry, y'all, it is going to be hot and muggy for you guys. I mean, look at these temperatures in the 90s. 96 will be our high for many parts of the PD Monday and 95 as we head into Tuesday, Wednesday, still in the 90s. So again, many parts of the PD, if you do have to work outside, keep yourself cool and hydrated. If you want to take the dog on a walk, it's best likely to do it in the morning hours or do it late in the evening hours. So again, it's still going to be hot out there. Luckily, though, we are going to see a little bit of relief as we head into next weekend.